One key to unlocking this pandemic is figuring out whether patients who've already had the virus have lasting immunity. A new study suggests for a significant portion of those infected, immunity may diminish within months. I think it's amazingly important as far as the information it provides. Chinese researchers compared 37 asymptomatic people to 37 who had mild COVID-19 symptoms. Researchers found more than 90% of participants in both groups had only low levels of antibodies in their blood just two to three months after being infected. In 40% of asymptomatic cases, no antibodies could be detected after eight weeks. It starts to kind of give us some information about what the immune response looks like. When a virus enters the body, our immune system creates antibodies to stick to it, so the virus can't enter our cells. Having few or no lasting antibodies doesn't necessarily mean the person can be reinfected right away. Other virus-killing cells might jump into action, but experts say it does cast doubt on antibody testing. Until we know exactly what part of the immune system is protective, it's difficult to be able to do a test and tell someone you're safe or not. In one-third of asymptomatic patients, the Chinese study also found lung damage that's been seen in COVID-19 patients. Experts say larger studies are certainly needed, but it's estimated at least 20% of those infected with this coronavirus are asymptomatic. If those patients do not have protective immunity, things will get tricky. That means people can be infected, and that means we can't rely on herd immunity to protect the population, we really need the vaccine. And it will have to offer people something the virus itself may not. Strong, longer-lasting protection. Christine Burak, CBC News, Toronto.